Her case is interesting because it sort of illustrates how, what a difficult time Western medicine has with identifying the source of pain when there's nothing obvious that shows up on a blood test or an imaging study or whatever. The fact that she'd seen all these other doctors and undergone all these other imaging studies and just everything else, you know, kind of a million dollar workup and nothing had come up, that means just that alone means that it's likely to be a peripheral nerve problem of some sort. Based on her description, it, it, it was pretty clear that this is very likely to be a, just an entrapment of one of these small anterior cutaneous nerves. Had her set up for some diagnostic blocks and again, she got a great result. It was a fairly straightforward process to just take her to the operating room, make a small incision directly over the area of tenderness and then carefully dissect down and find the nerve that was the problem and then address it.